In physics, the interaction between things, or particles, is described by the concept of force. Force is a vector quantity, which means it has both magnitude and direction. An object's velocity, and even its shape can be changed by force. Newton's equations of motion state that force is the result of an object's mass multiplied by its acceleration. The Newton, N, which bears Sir Isaac Newton's name, is the unit of force used in the International System of Units, SI. Its definition is the force necessary to accelerate a 1 kilogram mass by 1 meter per second squared. Pushing, tugging, friction, and other contact, as well as non-contact forces, like gravitational and electromagnetic forces, can all be used to exert force. Typical examples of forces include 1. Gravity. This is the force of attraction between objects with mass. It is responsible for the weight of an object and its interaction with other objects in the universe. 2. The force that prevents an object from moving when it comes into contact with another surface is known as friction. Friction can be advantageous, for example, traction, or it can be harmful, for example, energy loss. 3. Normal force is the pressure that a surface applies to bear the weight of an object that is resting on it. It operates perpendicular to the surface and blocks object passage. 4. When a string, rope, or cable is pulled taut, tension is the force that is communicated through it and aids in preserving its integrity. 5. The force brought on by electric charges and magnetic fields is known as the electromagnetic force. It controls how charged particles, magnets, and electric currents interact. 6. Applied force is the force that a person or another object exerts directly on an object. There are many more different kinds of forces in physics. These are but a few examples. Newton's laws of motion and other scientific principles, which define how objects move and behave, depend critically on forces.